Hey everyone, I just want to say in advance, sorry for this bad intro, I've been trying to do this intro for several minutes and I just can't get it right, but here's my last and final attempt. Hey everyone, welcome back to TIE Fire Network, so today we're going to be playing some more Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time Randomizer. Okay, good, I did it. See, I don't know why this has to be so goddamn bad, but I can't say it fucking at all today, so I'm done. I'm done, that was it. But uh, anyway, so I can finally get past the goddamn intro and get into the actual uh, fucking game. Uh, uh, let me just... Okay, make sure this is all correct. Sorry. I should have done this before. I thought I had. Okay, I guess all looks good. We're all good. So uh, anyway, the reason I have OBS here showing like this is because I wanted to go over something. And uh, sorry for how I'm going over this. It's just I'm tired of this intro, so I'm done with it. But uh, anyway... Last session I did, I did like 10 or so days ago, uh, was uh, my fifth session recording Ocarina of Time Randomizer. Uh, anyway, uh, session 5 would be all the episodes after Silent Forest Temple, which I believe is 19. So it would be all episodes uh, of 20 to last episode would be session 5. And uh, what I gotta say is, they all had this issue... That I had no idea existed because I, I, I had used to use Bandicam for the previous sessions and with screen recording, which, if you don't know, has no lag when I Alt-Enter uh, into uh, Project 64. So basically, as I'm sure you've seen, every time I would go in and out of full screen and into Emo Tracker with the uh, Project 64 here, it would have a black screen for roughly three seconds, and uh, I had no idea this was happening. I took some time, and uh, I managed to fix it in my OBS settings, so I have it set up in this way. So if anyone's familiar with OBS, or if you want to learn, basically what I, what I did is I created a scene. I, I, I record in a stupid way like this. I have several scenes all in the same scene collection or whatever, but anyway... I have this one, Uter, and I put uh, a display capture here. This one is what I was experimenting with. I uh, have it disabled, but I left it there just in case. I don't know. OBS is a little funky. Then I have a, I believe this is a either a window capture or a game capture. I'm not sure. Okay, I think it's a window capture set to Project 64, and I have it down here. So basically, when I do it this way, and also I want to apologize, I have to mute a couple things, but... Uh, anyway, never mind that. Basically, how it goes is uh, if I press uh, F2 to unpause this, uh, I didn't mean to alt enter so soon. Basically, what happens is uh, it will show the Project 64 thing whenever I want it to, but if I click on the Emo Tracker, uh, it should only be showing Emo Tracker in whatever other window is here. But if I click into Project 64, as you can see, you know, on the video and in the OBS preview for me, whoops, uh, <laughs> sorry, this is really stupid. As you can see in the OBS preview, it also shows it, so yeah. But basically, when I go into full screen with it now, there is almost no uh, black screen. As you can see, all around the uh, Project 64 window, until I click out of it, there is a bit of a black screen, but that goes away. But uh, still, you can still see the game, so there's like, what I'm trying to say is there's not as much of a total black screen as there was in the previous episodes. And I know that's the poorest way of explaining it, but basically before, you had a black screen for three seconds with absolutely nothing in it. Now you have a black screen that may last for three seconds, but as soon as I click on Emo Tracker, I think it shows it. But still, you see the game anyway, even if it doesn't. So regardless, you're not missing as much of the screen. It's not going to look as stupid this way. So yeah, that's still a bad way of going over it, but I'm not going to redo this intro. I'm sorry, but if you don't get it, I'm sorry, but hopefully you do. Now, I just I need a sec, so give me one second and we'll get right into the recording. So see you in just a second, okay? Okay, I'm back. So uh, I've, I've collected my thoughts again after that terrible intro and, and my explanation, but uh, anyway, here we are. We're going to get right into the game. So uh, basically, we'll go over this real quick, though. We have our emo tracker stuff here. This is what we've accomplished thus far, uh, and I kind of have a decent understanding of the map. What the hell? I don't know if you can see that, but my phone disconnected from my OBS thing. What the fuck? <laughs> Whatever, it doesn't matter. Whatever, fuck that shit, who cares? 
Who fucking cares? Uh, anyway, <laughs> sorry about that again. Uh, we have all this done. I'm not going to go over every single little uh, blip here, but... Uh, basically, we got a lot of shit now. We got a bottle last time. We got the gauntlets last, or the silver gauntlet last time. We found a place to buy this, which I believe I did buy. So that's great. Um, we sold the Keaton mask. Uh, hmm. Uh, it looks like we got a couple stick upgrades. Uh, we bought the minuet of the forest. Um... We did some stuff with the keys, too, and we got the hover boots, as well as the fire tunic, or whatever it's called. Goron tunic, I, I don't know. But yeah, as you can see, we did a lot of shit. So anyway, we're going to get right into the game now. So uh, here we are in the, uh, the water temple with the most legendary music combination I've ever seen. And another funny thing, if you forget, is this is inside Dodongo's cavern, which is fucking hilarious to me. But uh, anyway, let's proceed in this. So we have several keys for here. This is the dungeon we have the most keys for. So that's why we're here. Reluctantly though, I don't actually want to be here. However, it would appear to be necessary. Also, I, I really want to point out, when we're near an enemy in here, it, uh, it continues to uh, play this owl theme. You know, the owl theme, everyone knows it. But it also plays the, uh, like, the battle thing. See, you can hear it? And they play simultaneously, which is just fucking legendary. Okay, well, kind of. If I go over here, they'll kind of play simultaneously, I think. See? See, they're playing simultaneously. I, I noticed that last, uh, session. I just, I don't think I wanted to say anything about it then, but, yeah. Also, I, I, I need to apologize again, and I'm sorry, this episode's been a lot of weird shit, exposition, intro, apology, and shit like that, but I, I keep... I don't know why, every time I start recording, I immediately, for some reason, start fucking salivating like crazy, and it's so fucking annoying, I have to constantly mute me, fucking swallowing, to fucking talk correctly so I don't sound like... You know what I'm saying? So... I'm really sorry about that, and it's something that greatly pisses me off personally. So that's why I take so much passion in the subject. But anyway, f fuck that shit, we're getting right into this. Um, I have no idea how long I have to record this session. Sorry, I had to make sure my volume was right, it sounds really goddamn loud. But yeah, anyway, I have no idea how long I'm going to be recording this session. I don't know how much of a time I'll have, but... Uh, regardless, I plan on recording a lot today if I can. Uh, it's a little later in the day. I'm sure you saw when I was on my desktop screen, but, uh, yeah, anyway, let me figure out if I can do this room. I'm not sure if this requires the long shot or if it's just really fucking annoying. Or perhaps both. I have memories of this room. And when it comes to Zelda temples, having memories of them like this uh, is not a good thing. It's not like a nostalgia memory or a good memory, it's a fucking shit memory. So, yeah, I don't like this room. But it doesn't seem so bad now. Maybe I was just terrible at it when I was younger. Which is, you know, all too likely, honestly. The older you get, the better you are at most things. And here we go! Past it. We got through. Fuck this room. It's a piece of shit. I saw that. Let's get this. Also, what is this harp in the background? Is this, like, that harp part always there? It's not here right now. I mean, like, is it in the original Owl song? Okay, what's that gonna be? <laughs> I wonder if that's a stick or a stick upgrade. Um, hmm. Now the question is, do I go for it or... Or what? Because, I mean, I just got here, so... I mean, how far is it? It's out of my reach, so I'd have to go... Man, maybe I'll just wait. I'll come back and get it later. I don't give a shit. We'll go back for it at some other point when we have the long shot, which is very unlikely in here, but... Hey, you know, whatever. Okay, so I don't know why I did that. I just... I think I have to. Okay, take that guy out. Now, uh... Hmm. There's some sort of trick to this, and I forget what it is. Uh, hopefully I don't need the long shot in here. I really hope I hope I don't. No, wait, 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 wait. What's the trick with this dude? Oh, I see. I understand. 
Fuck off, bro. So we gotta shoot this. Good thing I have a good amount of arrows. I think I'm actually an arrow so short, though, which is a, a very unfortunate thing. But uh, <laughs> whatever, I guess. We'll make it through, regardless of that. Whoa, Link, don't be going flying across that shit, man. Okay, we'll shoot that with the hook shot. And then we'll kill this guy before he knocks us down. Okay, he's gone. Fucking eradicated. Bye-bye, bitch. And then we go here, and we shoot this. Hopefully there's no hidden chests in here. I don't know. We don't have the map or the compass, so it'd be hard to tell, honestly. Hmm. Okay, shoot that again. Okay, so it looks like you don't need arrows in here at all. I guess I was being stupid. Okay, let's come up here and kill these dudes. And hopefully my tunic isn't stolen by this asshat. Or whatever his name is. Like, like, I don't care. Okay, cool, he's dead. No problem. Good thing I got the big Goron sword. Oh, money, yeah, hell yeah. We need that. I wasted a lot on the treasure game last uh, session. Don't know what episode it was, I have not edited it yet. So, yeah. Whoa, wow, uh huh? Link? Oh! I didn't know we could do this yet. Okay, let's kill Link. It's very, very fun. Hello, Link. Where are you? I don't see him. Isn't he supposed to be here by the tree? Link? Link? Where'd you go? Bro, where the fuck are you? Huh? Hey, there he is. Let's go kill his ass. This is the best music to kill Link. Also, what's Nabby have to say? Let me take care of the village. I'm counting on you, Typhiro, too. Great, great, Nabby. You always say the most useful and definitely relevant shit. Shut the fuck up, Link. I'll kill your ass. I'm not afraid to kill you. Okay, how do I kill this guy? I, for I forget the proper procedures to kill this dude. I hit him. Wish I had the goddamn hammer. That'd work. that works. You just kind of got to get him at an angle. He ain't doing a lot of fucking damage and he's dead. He's gone. Bye-bye. Although that poor ass dude does not carry as much money as I do. He carries a piss poor amount. 20 goddamn rupees? Well, how pathetic. But anyway, he's dead now. That was easy, thankfully. Big Goron Sword does a good amount and we have the uh, half damage. Good thing he didn't have that. But anyway, let's do this. Wait, I don't think I can progress. Wait, what? <laughs> no, no, no way! There you go, you gotta be kidding me! No way! No fucking way! That is absurd! Hell no! Are you kidding me? That already? Wait, uh, I can't do this yet, man! Whatever, I guess I'll just do that. I could put a note, but I am not bothering with that shit. Fuck that. Also, I can't proceed because no ocarina, no song of time. So yeah, we're going back the other way. Uh, there's got to be a catch. Like, I don't think you're supposed to go there that early. What changed? I don't have the long shot, do I? When? There's no way. Do I? This ain't the long shot. This is the hook shot. So wait, why? I thought it took a bit of time to get here. Maybe maybe getting your first key usually takes longer. Oh, shit. He's gonna steal my Goron tunic, and I'm gonna kill his ass for it. Wait, he didn't steal it. What? You gotta be kidding me, right? He didn't do it. Maybe they took that out of the game in this version. Wait, am I stuck here? Oh, no. Okay, I know what to do, though. This is, uh, this is a very simple fix. We do that right there. And then, uh, hold on, I'm, I'm opening my phone. Sorry, I wanted to make sure I'm still recording. Okay, then what we do is we uh, we save state just in case, and then we restart the game. And hopefully I didn't fuck it up. Then we speed up. Actually, we keep speeding up, get through here quicker, and then we open this. Wait. That's mine. 
And we're back here into the water temple, and we should... Yeah, we did it, we did it, we did it. We're missing a key. Okay, we did it. So, I'm actually thinking now, this might be really bad. We don't have the iron boots, which is, uh... That's not good. It's not a good thing to uh, be missing when you're in the water temple. But, uh, the reason I bring this up is we have so many keys for here. Is what, I'm, what I'm trying to say is, I thought we could get pretty far in this temple, but actually, we can't do shit. Because we're missing a highly important item. Since we don't have the goddamn iron boots, we can't actually access any of the areas, really, that require a goddamn key. So, what I'm saying here is we're stuck. I can't reach that. It's long shot, so... Actually, I can't do shit here. Wow, this is this is actually really uh, disappointing. I didn't think we'd get stuck. I thought we actually had an ability to get through here. But I forgot a fundamental thing of the water temple is that you need to go down under the water before you can do pretty much anything. So yeah, oops. That was pretty damn stupid. <laughs> but uh, I guess that's no biggie. I guess we'll just we'll get the hell out of here after I collect this uh, this dude's stick over here. So hold on. Okay, so how can I reach him? Can I reach this dude? Or do I actually need the long shot? Okay, I actually need the long shot to get to him. So tell you what, we're not gonna do that. We're just straight up not gonna do this. We're gonna leave because we can't do anything here. I guess. We got, uh, I guess you could say, a decent item from here, so yeah. I hope we don't need the iron boots to get out of here, that would really suck. But it looks like we don't, so I guess we'll just leave. I don't know how this works, we got water here, but then we also got air here, so you know, whatever. So I guess this tunnel leads down into Lake Hylia somehow. Some weird shit, man. But, oh god, whoa! God damn, we're getting crushed by boulders and shit. Okay, I was not ready for that. Hmm. So I'm not sure where we should go next. Uh, what? You're rolling through that rock that's sitting there. What the fuck, man? That's weird. You shouldn't be doing that. Now I'm thinking, is there anything I can do down here? In uh, Lon Lon Ranch? Because that's what's down here. Lon Lon Ranch is there. I don't think there's actually anything I can do there. And I already did the shooting minigame, so there's no more to do with that. I swear these rocks take the weirdest path, but uh, I guess, yeah, whatever. Uh, what was back here in Goron City? What was this? I remember this was, uh, was this Gerudo Valley? What was this? This was something important, wasn't it? Or, or, wait, I don't know where this was. Where is this? Oh, it is Gerudo Valley. Okay, I wasn't mistaken. Okay. Uh, it's not so surprising in the end, I suppose, but whatever. Hmm. What was in here again? The store? The one with all the good shit? Yeah, it was. Okay, nothing of use in there, I suppose. Wait, actually, I just realized that arrow I passed up uh, pretty nonchalantly might actually be important, so... Let me look at the cost. 80 rupees. I will buy it, because perhaps it's an arrow uh, capacity upgrade. I'm not going to read all that. Okay, don't buy. Now let's pause, and it would appear that it was actually just five arrows. Man. Whoops, I, I don't know what that is. Whoops, I shouldn't have pressed that. Okay, so it wasn't an arrow upgrade, which... Yeah, whatever. I thought it could have been. I guess that would be shaped like a quiver, wouldn't it? Not an arrow. So whatever, I bought five arrows instead. Oops. But anyway, f fuck that shit. We're getting right into this. 